This is Ambazar's DIY and other stuff. My name is Amber Meeks. Today is Subscription Box Saturday. And on this video, I have for you one of my favorite subscription boxes, the Heroes Tower. Guys, you know how much I love and look forward to this box every single month. And now the owner threw in this craft challenge that we're doing. And I'm really super stoked to see what he made and show you guys what I made with the two boxes that he sent to me for the craft challenge. So without further ado, Let's see what's in the box and what we made for our craft challenge. Okay, guys, so <clears throat> here's the box. I haven't peeked. I opened it, but you know, he's kept this really, really like secure. <laughs> he doesn't want me to know anything until it's opened. So here we go. I took off the top here. It says just a protective barrier. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Awesome. And then we have the card. I'm sure this is the Patreon. Thank you. And it is, it says, thank you. Oops. Got it. Great. <laughs> okay. Thank you for another month of support. I appreciate your help and thoroughly enjoy your unboxing boxes. <laughs> Keep up the good work and take a break, girl. Take care and be safe. <laughs> break. What does that mean? I think you guys are going to have to explain that one to me. <laughs> break is not something I understand. Okay, guys. So I also wanted to make it clear because my niece brought it to my attention that when I'm unboxing um, things on the video that I don't explain the fact that he can customize these boxes to what it is that you like. So the, the types of things that he puts in the boxes for me are the type of things that I'm into. So he can do the same for you. So these are totally customizable boxes. You just have to let him know what kind of geeky things you're into. All right, guys. So here is their um, little flyer. And I put, I do have an item list inside my mystery box. And if you guys are interested in getting this box, I'm pretty sure they're still sold out on Crate Joy, but I will link the Crate Joy link in the description box below. And if they are sold out, just make sure that you email him at theheroespower at hotmail.com and he can still send you a box. Okay. So that's that. Okay. So this is the actual mystery box. Ooh. We have a nice long note. Uh-oh. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. So for those of you here for the mystery box unboxing, we'll go ahead and do this first. And I will save all the fun craft challenge stuff for after the unboxing. Okay, I have to stop myself right there because the craft challenge items that he included are also part of my mystery box. There's one extra special item that you have to see. So please stay tuned to see the craft challenge items and that extra special item that are also part of my mystery box. All right, let's move on. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. See what kind of goodies I got this month. Yay. Okay, we'll set that aside. It's all bubble wrapped. There's my item list. Awesome, awesome. Let's take the item list off so I don't lose it and I have it if I need it. I might know everything. I might not. All right, let's open this up and see where we are at. Okay. I'm going to take... Ooh. Ooh. Hello. Hello, Michelangelo. We have a super cute on the top here, a Michelangelo. No, I'm sorry. It's Raphael. I thought those were nunchucks. They are not. They are the twin size. So that would be Raphael. And it is an adorable keychain. Look at that. Yes. It's definitely Raph. He's got the twin side right there. So it's definitely Raphael. I don't know why I thought I saw nunchucks. I'm crazy. Whatever. There is the back of it, guys. This is super cute. I love this kind of stuff. But I'm always afraid to put these on my keychain because they're just so cute. I don't want to mess them up. So I usually just kind of, you know, keep them. <laughs> I don't do anything with them. All right. So let's see what's in here. Spider-Man. This has a collector's key ring. Okay. So here's the package that it's in, guys. And let's check it out. Let's see what they got for me here. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, I do. Look at that. Bam. I'm getting more prepared. Okay. Let's take a look at this. Oh, he's cute. Ah! <laughs> I love this. He's so cute. Look at him. Oh, I don't you just want to pinch his cheeks? He's like winking. How 
funny is that? There's the back of it. That is so stinking cute. Guys, I really like that. He's like winking. That is hysterical. Okay, that is awesome. So that was a cool thing to put in there. Oh, yes. I mean, oh, yes. I'm so stoked because I am working on some Wonder Woman stuff and I have a Wonder Woman patch. How awesome is that, guys? I'm so super stoked. You have no idea because I'm working on some Wonder Woman stuff right now. Top secret. You guys won't get to see it until later. Yes, Transformers Magnet. Hello. Yes, yes, and more yes. Guys, I'm the biggest geek ever when it comes to the Transformers. I ordered the whole um, movie series. So I have all of them now. I'm so super stoked. And I just watch them, you know, all the time. I think that's normal. So here we have, it looks like the Justice League. We have women's, uh, Wonder Woman, women's. <laughs> we have Wonder Woman, Batman, uh, The Flash. Um, don't tell me the guy's name. Aquaman, Superman. You guys know the drill. Look at that. Awesome. And it is a magnet. So that is so super cool, guys. I love getting magnets. I love it, love it, love it. I have a lot of fridge space because I have multiple fridges to put magnets on. So that is awesome. Okay. What kind of goodies are in here? Let's pop all this open. Awesome. Awesome. So we have a tiny little stamp. How do I put that? Right there. Awesome. Okay. Oh, stop it. <laughs> uh, journey into mystery. The mighty Thor cannot reach his enchanted hammer. Is this to be Loki's final victory? No. Love it. <laughs> this is awesome, guys. It is a postcard, and he did include the little postage stamp for me to send this, the, send this to somebody. But you know I won't. I mean, it's Thor can't send that to somebody. Okay. Now, oh, yes. Thundercats, lion -O, and Panthro. What? Oh, yes. Look at that. All right. It's an awesome bookmark. That is super cool. Yes, guys. Thundercats, remember that? Oh, so awesome. Love my Thundercats. Okay. That is cool. Oh, cool. So we have some Spider-Man stickers. All right, now I might have to do a Spider-Man pair of shoes. Oh, yes. Look at this, guys. Spider-Man stickers. Awesome, awesome, awesome. What am I going to do with these? I don't know. You guys will just have to wait and see. And now we are into the comic books. We have Year of the Villain, Dark Gifts, The Justice League. Awesome. Look at that. Yes, yes, and I am going to start crafting with the comic books. Chad said I could. I'm just saying. So, I mean, if Chad says I'm allowed, then that's exactly what I'm going to do. Okay, so then we have, ooh, Aquaman. That's a cool pack. Yes, look at that. I am a huge Aquaman fan, especially of the actor that they chose to play Aquaman. Yes, please. All right, that is super cool. Oops. Hold on. Raphael's pushing stuff off. Oh, this is cute. I thought you and Noah might like this. Hope you two can geek out together or maybe come up with a craft idea. Oh, I love it. Oh, how fun. We will have fun with this. It's an Avengers Big Fun Book of Color. Look how cool this is, guys. I'll come back a little bit. Ah! Yes, yes, yes. I'm sure that he will color some masterpieces. We can definitely... Oh, there's more than that. There's all kinds of activities and stuff in here. Oh, this is great for him. Oh, yes. And for me, I'm just lying. All right, guys. That was my Heroes Tower mystery box for the month of... What are we in? We're in April. Is this April's box or is May? No, it's April, right? Yeah, April. <laughs> That was my Heroes Tower mystery box for the month of April. Chad, you always do an awesome job with this box. I absolutely love it. And again, if anybody is interested in getting this box, I will have everything linked in the description box below. Now, let's get into the fun part. The craft challenge. Woo! Okay, so he's got this nice note here. So it says, greetings, Amber. I hope you enjoy the mystery box. The craft challenge items, they're yours. Ooh. Yay! And next month's craft challenge, please open in any way you choose on your channel, and I will provide a brief description below. Oh, don't read until I'm ready, as there will be spoilers. Okay, I don't want spoilers. Okay, so here we go. Let's see what's all in here. 
Okay, this is for the May craft challenge. All right. Hold up. Open last. Part of the mystery box box that goes with the craft challenge. Oh, I have something additional for my mystery box, but I have to open it last. So, okay, that is the craft challenge item for May. I'm sorry, guys. We're just starting this. This is new to me. I'm getting used to it. Okay, so here's box number one. So I'm guessing this is what he made with the boxes that uh, were part of the craft challenge. So let me show you what he made, and then I'm going to show you what I made. Okay, all right, so let's open this up. He's got it all mysterious and everything. Let's see what he did. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, this is awesome. <laughs> so it's like a decorative, oh, yes, just the same fight you've always fought, only this time you don't win. Well, I don't like that, but this is cool. I want to win every time. This is cool. Look at this, guys. So it's like a decorative box. He's got it all encased here so that it's protected. Let me just show you all of the sides here. There's the back. Here's this side here. And then this side here. So I'm just going to show you all the sides. This is very cool. I'm digging it. Totally digging it. Good job. Good job. All right. So that's one thing that he made. And here's another one. Challenge number two. So what is a noose has to come? Okay, so this is challenge the lion. Okay, this is awesome. I'm sorry, guys. I just love this kind of stuff. This is very cool. So again, another super cool decorative box with all kinds of fun geeky stuff that I love so very much. Okay, so those are that. I'm supposed to open this. Am I supposed to open this before I show you mine? I'm gonna open it. <laughs> doesn't say it says it goes with the craft challenge so I'm gonna open it let's see what else happened here oh this is so cool and it even has the thing <gasps> her rope oh this is cool oh I love it look at this guys <gasps> how awesome is that it's a wonder woman Funko Pop thingamabobber I love it though you totally know this one is Wonder Woman there's no mistaking it oh I want to take her out of here I want to show her to you guys oh my gosh this is so awesome <laughs> love Wonder Woman who doesn't love Wonder Woman oh yes guys oh this is so awesome look at that <gasps> this is gonna look so great in my geeky area I love it love it love it there's the back of it oh my gosh you guys this is so so cute all right, Chad. Okay, I see you. This is awesome. I love it. I absolutely love it. Okay. Okay, guys. So I read all of his notes after I unboxed his craft. And really, I should have read it before I unboxed his craft because the idea for his craft is that those are display boxes for the Wonder Woman figurine. How cool is that? So I just want to show you the clip of where I realized that and then we'll move on to what I made. Oh, so I can take Wonder Woman out of her box and display her on these. So these are like display boxes. I love that idea. That is so super cool. So I would take the Wonder Woman that you guys saw me unbox and I would put her on top of this box so she has a thing to be displayed on. Love that idea, Chad. Brilliant. So what did I make with the two boxes? So this is what Chad came up with. Super cool. Really great, right? So courtesy of one of my subscribers, her name is Kim. She does not have a channel. She suggested that I make this. And as soon as she suggested it, I saw it in my head. So let me grab it. It's right over here. Are you guys ready? This was a suggestion of one of my subscribers. And here it is. What? Yes, I made a little Pac-Man arcade. How cute is that, guys? I didn't 
with a little controller on the top of it. And then I have some Pac-Man stuff on the sides of it. And then here's the other side. It is exactly the same. How fun is that? She's like, too bad you can't make yourself a little Pac-Man arcade. Why is it crooked? Do you see how it's crooked? I wonder why it's doing that. At any rate, um, yes, I made a Pac-Man arcade. I took both of those boxes that he sent to me. I folded them out and I put this together. I will have a tutorial on how I made this for anybody who's interested on one of my Naked Mondays coming up very soon. So Chad made these two very cool boxes and I made the Pac-Man arcade. So tell me, which was your favorite craft, guys? I'm just very curious. We are both just having fun with this, so be polite in the comments. Chad is a very talented crafter and I totally respect all of his work. I love what he did with the box. Do you guys like mine? Or do you like his? Just do a little, hey, this was a super fun challenge. You both did a great job kind of thing. And just let me know which one was your favorite. That's all. We're just having fun here, guys. Please keep that in mind. We're just having fun. No need to be mean or nasty because Chad is extremely talented. But I'm happy with my little Pac-Man arcade. I think it's super fun. Okay, so again, that was a suggestion of one of my subscribers, Kim. She's like, too bad you can't take those boxes and turn it into a little mini Pac-Man arcade somehow. I mean, the instant I saw that, I was like, yes, I saw it in the boxes. I was so super excited. So Kim, thank you very much for that suggestion because I made a really cool craft with your suggestion. And Chad, thank you so much for this challenge. It was so incredibly fun. Now, we have a May challenge, guys. Let's see what he sent me this time. Oh boy. Ay, 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 I'm scared. <laughs> this was so much fun though. I had so much fun making it. Okay. Okay. Oh boy. Labels. What am I going to do with this? All right. He didn't say that there was any, you know, okay, hold on. He did leave some things that I'm supposed to read here. So hold on a second. So the craft challenge item for the month of May, what you will make with these. I already have a great idea and I look forward to seeing what you will do. The sky's the limit. Use as many or as little of the items as you want. You can use any other materials you need to round two craft <laughs> until month next month take care and be safe okay so i love how he explained his craft how he made this craft and um he also had a suggestion for how to use the craft i love that idea that is so super fun so here's the thing guys uh this time i have these teenage mutant ninja turtles labels oh boy what am I going to make with these guys? I mean, I love stickers and all that kind of stuff, but these are labels. So that takes the challenge to like a little bit more of a different level. So it does not say in the rules that I can't ask you guys again. Suggestions. Kim made a fabulous suggestion last month. Do any of you guys have a suggestion for what I can make with these awesome Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles labels? for next month's craft. I'm gonna start brainstorming, but if you guys have any suggestions, please let me know in the description box below. Chad, thank you so much. This was so super fun. I love getting my subscribers involved with this. I'm so glad that Kim made that suggestion because I think I made something super cute. All right, guys, that's all I got for you in this video, and I'll catch you in my next one. Gorgeous people. Was that loud? What? Yeah, probably. Try it again. This is Ambazar's DIY and other stuff. My name is Amber Meeks. Today's subscription box Saturday. Why am I? Woo! Meeks. Woo! Doing a lot of high notes. Yeah, try it again. You guys know how much I love this one. And now Chad decided, who is the owner of the Heroes Tower, decided to throw in some. I lost my train of thought. It's such good momentum until then. <laughs> All right. Okay, guys. So, whoa. That was dangerous. Should I throw it? That was so dangerous. I'll try throwing it one more time. <laughs>